Hello everyone, it's Matilda. welcome back to my channel. So I'm doing a sit down video today, which feels really weird because I feel like I only do vlogs anymore, but I'm doing a sit down video and showing you guys what I got for Christmas. So I was a bit hesitant about filming this video, but I've been getting so many DMs and like comments and TikToks and stuff asking me to show you guys what I got. So I thought I'd just do a video and show you. So I've got my Christmas sack. I don't know if you guys do this as well, but I've had this since I was like, I mean, probably a baby for so long. So yeah, so I'm gonna show you guys what I got. And obviously, as you know, literally every YouTuber says it, not trying to brag, boast, whatever, but um, I'm honestly so grateful. I feel like I've been sport rotten this year and yeah, I'm just beyond thankful to my family for being able to gift me these sort of things. So yeah, if you, if any of you were there on Christmas day, I literally was saying thank you so many times. My mum was like, okay, can you stop now? <laughs> yeah, I've just been sport rotten, so. Yes, I feel very, very grateful, and yeah, I thought I'd show you guys what I got, so vamos. I was going to start off with stocking fillers and kind of work my way up, but I realised that's going to be probably quite boring for you. I feel like you want to see the main presents first, and then I do stocking fillers at the end, and if you don't want to watch the stocking fillers, then you don't have to. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to start with my main present because... I literally, I wanted to cry when I saw these. So, my main present was some boots. Now, I've been after some boots like this for a very, very long time, like some sort of dressy going out boot slash heels because, yeah, I feel like all my going out shoes are pretty bright colors. Sometimes I just wanna have a nice black pair. So, I got these Burberry boots. I'm literally, guys, can we just look at the silhouette? Like, I've worn them already, so they're a bit um, scuffed. But they're like sock boots, like kind of like the Balenciaga ones, but not Balenciaga because we're boycotting that. I just, I'm so so beyond grateful, honestly. Also, just to let you know that all my presents are secondhand. I pretty much only shop secondhand, so whenever my mum asks me what I want, I just send her screenshots of stuff I like on Depop. So um. Yeah, all these things are secondhand, so we'd not be able to afford them normally. I don't know, you know, what season they are or anything. I should probably do my research, but yeah, I got them from Depop, hence the, um, you know, the battered box. And the next thing I got was this skirt, which, oh my God, I just, I just have been wearing all my Christmas presents so much. I need to wash them, but I'm just so obsessed with them that I'm just... <laughs> Anyway, I got this Izumiyaki Please Please skirt, which uh, I need some colour in my wardrobe. I've been wearing so much black recently. I know I just show the black shoes, but I need some colourful outfits, like clothes. It's just this long pleated skirt. It's sort of purple and white alternate stripes, and it's very structured, so it has this seam in the side, if you can see, which gives it a really structured look when you wear it, if that makes sense. And it's pretty long. It's like sort of just above the ankle I'd say. I like to wear it in summer as well. I feel like because pleats are such like a sheer material, not sheer, like lightweight material, it's gonna be perfect just chuck on top of a bikini or something. I'm also just gonna be wearing it every day in winter, so. I then got some sunglasses because I hate all my sunglasses. Like, I feel like I just don't wear them that much and I don't know, I just, I just wanted some new nice sunglasses, so. My mum got me some, this was actually really funny. It came in this um, tobacco heating system box. And I was like, my mum's got me like a electric cigarette. I was like really confused. I was like, oh, thank you. And then I opened it up and it was like covered in um, tissue paper. And I was like, what was that? And then I saw the gorgeous Mew Mew sunglasses. They're so beautiful. Like the detail on the side, can you see that? I'm gonna do the YouTuber thing that they all do. So this is the side detail. Which I love, the gold. <laughs> you can see me. But this is what they look like, oh my god. So gorgeous, I love how it's fully connected the whole way. I feel like they're going to be good for dressy outfits, but also just casual, like when you're wearing a tracksuit and you kind of don't want to be seen on the way to uni sort of thing. These are going to be perfect, so yeah. I just can't, just can't believe me look. I'm going to move on to what my boyfriend got me quickly because I'm actually wearing one of the items, but... My boyfriend Toby, again, I was sport rotten, but he got me this Aries jumper, which, oh, I just love it. It's in the, I think it's the stone colour. Maybe it's sort of this um, beige. It's 
kind of really similar to my skin, but I kind of like it. It's just the normal crew neck style. And this is in a size small. Yeah, I love it. It fits perfectly. It's not too baggy, not too tight. I've been wearing this pretty much every day. I should probably wash it, but I love it so much. <laughs> Yay, thanks to Toby. I got him some wallabies, but obviously you won't see that. And then he got me this hat, which I can't put on now because I've got my hair up, which is really annoying, but it's just this burgundy, like wine color fur hat. Again, off Depop. It's so cool. I just wanted like a nice sort of glam one and you can have it down or you can flip up this which i think actually suits me more when i flip it up i think it just is a bit more flattering on my um egghead <laughs> and it'll probably go with my skirt because it's like similar sort of tones but i was gonna wear the other day but i was wearing the sunglass and i thought i looked a bit too extra to be wearing in like my little small hometown so i passed on that <laughs> also my brother has got me a present but postal strikes are doing us all dirty so um that hasn't arrived yet but he got me a bag and i'll show it to you in like another vlog or haul when it arrives but apparently the backlog is crazy like passes from november aren't, arri aren't arriving so who knows when we'll get that but um it's the thought that counts so i don't mind at all so it'd be like a nice little extra treat after christmas so i'm excited for that <laughs> so those were all my like main presents and i i literally how it goes out to my family i'm so grateful so now i'm moving to some smaller little bits but i forgot i also got the laura mercier setting powder but it's upstairs in my makeup bag but i have it on now but i can't really be asked to go upstairs and get it but i feel like you'll know what it is it's just the setting powder but i wanted that for a long time so yay <laughs> so i obviously got socks i feel like is it a christmas if you don't get socks i i always get so many pairs but um i got some black ones and then I got some white ones as well I don't know why they've all fallen out of the um of the pack then oh my god I got these socks which I was just blown away by but my mum got me some Gucci monogram socks oh, I know these are like burgundy they're long that's obviously got the tag on but they're long um with a little stripe and again these are from Depop not worn though, obviously they've still got the thing on. That would be a little bit gross. But these are gonna look so nice because they're a bit longer as like a statement sock and like with loafers. I'm just imagining the photo right now, to be honest with you. So I wanna get these in like every single colour, honestly. I, I just love the way they look as a statement sock because all my socks are like hidden. I wanna get some fun socks that everyone can see and talk about. So <laughs> maybe this should be the start of my sock collection. <laughs> I then got a little present which is so, so generous like and so thoughtful, I was literally so touched. Basically, I had this perfume from Byredo which I had like over a year ago, quite a while ago. And it was my everyday perfume when I first met my boyfriend and then I lost the perfume and it ran out and it was, it was long gone um, and I never knew what the name of the perfume was. I knew it was from Byredo but I never knew the name and I just, I, yeah, I just couldn't remember the name at all but I loved the scent. My boyfriend loved it because that's what he, that's like what reminds me of when we first met basically. Like it's a very nostalgic smell because it was quite strong as well. My parents got me a little Byredo set of all these samples so that I can smell them, like try them and work out which one it was. Like, that's just so, so thoughtful. I've spoken about it a lot how I want to try and find this perfume and the fact that they went to London, went in the shop and they asked the worker if they can get like loads of perfume samples. I don't think they even make these as a thing but yeah I'm going to try out all these and hopefully work out the scent and I can buy the full size ones so. I got this little hair thing, so I put my hair in a lady, which I don't know if that's what people call it, I don't think they do, but you know when you like tip your head upside down, put a towel on and whirl it up, I call that a lady, that's just what my mum has always called it, so in my family we just call it a lady, but yeah, it's like one of those little hair things that you wrap your hair in, and it's cute pink left prints, so love that. Oh, I got this orange claw clip, I got a candle smells divine in my flat me and toby always burn candles they're like on 24 7 but it means that they run out so much like literally can go through a fat candle in a week so i'm always needing a re-up on the candles and that one smells divine so very excited to bring that back to london with me then got this little clip it's got black diamantes on 
me and my mum were actually shopping in Brighton and I saw this and I think it was like three pounds or something. Something like that. So she was like, oh, I'll get it if you use a little stocking filler. So, yay. I got a Vaseline squeezy tube. If you don't know, get to know. Last time I was back home, my mum had one in her bag and I was literally flabbergasted at the fact that there was a Vaseline squeezy tube and it's the rosy one which is my favourite it's like such a nice colour on my lips and I stole it off her and was obsessed with it and was like posting on my story and stuff like guys what is this I was so confused but I loved it so she got me my own one so I gave her her one back when I went back to London but I just kept on thinking about it and I didn't know where to get it from I was just so in shock it was just it was amazing to me <laughs> So, my mum got me this. <laughs> it also got an orange nail varnish. Again, I love orange at the moment, so that'll go well with like all my clothes that are orange that I've been rinsing. And then last but certainly not least, I got MAC lipstick in the shade Brave. This is, if you know me, you will know, I've been wearing Brave my whole life. It is the literally only shade I will ever wear of any lipstick, MAC Brave. I've got about 10 like I've just I've gone through so many I wear it every day I put it on my cheeks as well I'm wearing it right now it's my favorite go-to color everyone always asks me and it always say MAC shade brave so um I think for my birthday my mom actually got me one as well but it's kind of just like a little staple that I always get because I literally wear it every single day even no makeup days I'm just like brave all over me my one's running out as well so this is perfect <laughs> yeah that is my Christmas haul I hope you guys enjoyed oh I've actually got fluffy socks on. <laughs> I got these um, navy blue fluffy socks. <laughs> these are actually one of my favourite presents just because of how amazing and warm they are. <laughs> but yeah, that is all for my Christmas haul. I hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys got and what you got up to on Christmas Day. Hope everyone had a lovely Christmas. Mine was really nice and chilled. It was just me and like my mum, dad and brother. So just my immediate family. Really chilled. Played Cards Against Humanity which always breaks some boundaries that you have <laughs> um lovely little wholesome christmas so let me know what you guys got up to and what your favorite presents were and yes i hope you enjoyed stay tuned for more videos my new resolution is to be on my youtube grind and instagram and tiktok i'm just gonna just flood you guys with content so stay tuned for that let me know what videos you want to see and yes make sure to like comment and subscribe and i'll see you in my next video bye